recent study by investigators from South Korea and the United States uncovered surprising details about Kim Jong-un, the leader of North Korea. Turns out he's really rich, like $5 billion rich. This makes us wonder how he got all that money and what he does with it. Kim Jong-un comes from a family that's been in charge of North Korea for three generations. He grew up living the good life, going to fancy schools, and now, as the leader, he's still living large. Even though other countries have put sanctions on North Korea, Kim Jong-un doesn't seem to care. He spends a ton of money on stuff like expensive cheese, fancy wine, and even luxury cars and watches. In this video, we'll take a closer look at Kim Jong-un's super expensive lifestyle. We'll talk about where his money comes from, what he spends it on, and how he manages to keep living the high life while his country faces tough times. Extravagant Spending Habits Okay, so Kim Jong-un has a ton of money, right? Well, he definitely knows how to spend it. Let's break it down. First off, there's the cheese. Kim Jong-un loves his cheese, and he spends a crazy amount of money on it. Like, in 2016, he dropped about $67,000 just on fancy cheese from Italy. That's a whole lot of cheddar. And get this, he's not just buying cheese, he's also splurging on chewing gum. Yeah, you heard that right. Kim Jong-un spent around $59,000 on chewing gum alone. That's a whole bunch of bubble blowing. But wait, there's more. Kim Jong-un also has a thing for wine and champagne. He's importing these fancy drinks from places like Italy, Bulgaria, and Macedonia, and he's shelling out about £219,000 for them. That's enough to make anyone feel a little tipsy. Now let's talk horses. Kim Jong-un loves horses, and he's not afraid to drop some serious cash on them. He spent $75,000 on 12 purebred horses imported from Russia. That's a whole stable full of expensive ponies. And here's the kicker. Kim Jong-un is also into golf. He's got these super fancy golf courses that he inherited from his dad, and they cost a fortune to build and maintain. We're talking millions of dollars here just to play a round of golf. So yeah, Kim Jong-un definitely knows how to live the high life. With all that money, he's living like a king, spending it on whatever he wants, whenever he wants. Sources of income. So how does Kim Jong-un get all that money? Well, there are a few ways. First off, he controls North Korea's military. That means he's in charge of all the soldiers and weapons. This is a big deal because the military is a big part of North Korea's economy. Then, there's money coming in from other countries. China, for example, gives North Korea financial support. This adds to Kim Jong-un's wallet. But that's not all. Kim Jong-un also has a bunch of businesses and investments overseas. This means he's making money from stuff happening outside of North Korea. Even though other countries don't always like what Kim Jong-un does, he's still able to make a lot of money and keep living the way he wants. Luxurious lifestyle of Kim Jong-un and his associates. Let's dive into the fancy world of Kim Jong-un and his buddies. First things first, let's talk about Kim's wife. She's all about the luxury too, even though she keeps to herself most of the time. When she does step out, she's rocking some high-end accessories like the Dior clutch bag. It's all about the bling for her. Now let's talk about what Kim Jong-un wears underneath it all. Yeah, we're talking about lingerie. In 2016 alone, he reportedly spent a whopping $3.8 million just on fancy underwear. That's a lot of lace and silk. But Kim Jong-un isn't just splurging on unmentionables. He's also got a thing for cars and watches. He's got this insane collection of luxury cars like Rolls Royces and Mercedes Benzies. He's got over a hundred of them and his favorite brand is Mercedes Benz. Talk about cruising in style. Let's talk about Kim Jong-un's obsession with watches. This guy loves his bling, especially when it comes to watches. He's got this collection of luxury timepieces that's worth over $8 million. We're talking about watches from fancy brands like Vacheron Constantine, and some of them cost as much as $660,000 each. That's a whole lot of cash to spend on something that tells time. And get this, Kim Jong-un isn't the only one with a thing for watches. His dad, Kim Jong-il, was also into them. It seems like luxury watches run in the family. 
Now let's switch gears and talk about music. Kim Jong-un is all about the tunes, especially American 80s music. He's got this secret band of female violinists who play for him and his crew. They even have their own 13-piece band. When they're not playing music, they're singing karaoke to their favorite American classics. But it's not just the violinists who are getting in on the action. Kim Jong-un himself loves to sing too. In fact, he's got this thing for the Doors and Jimi Hendrix classics. When he's in the mood for some tunes, he grabs a microphone and belts out his favorite songs. Talk about a rock star! Moving on, let's talk about how Kim Jong-un gets around in style. This guy doesn't travel like the rest of us. No, he's got his own fleet of fancy planes, helicopters and cars. When he's not flying in one of his private jets, he's cruising around in a motorcade with a bunch of fancy cars. And get this, Kim Jong-un even has his own yacht. Yeah, you heard that right. He's got this luxurious boat that's worth millions of dollars. It's got plush seating, televisions and even mini bars. Talk about cruising in style. But it's not just the air and sea where Kim Jong-un likes to travel. He's also got his own super secure train. This thing is like a fortress on wheels, with all sorts of security features to keep him safe. And when he's not riding the rails, he's hopping in a helicopter to get where he needs to go. Fortified Residences Lastly, let's take a look at where Kim Jong-un calls home. This guy doesn't just have one fancy house, he's got several. And they're not your average homes either, they're like fortresses, with all sorts of security features to keep him safe. One of Kim Jong-un's main residences is called the Rangsong Residence. It's huge, covering thousands of acres of land. And it's not just big, it's also super secure, with guards and fences all around. But that's not the only fancy pad Kim Jong-un has. He's also got the Kangdong and Wansan Residences, which are even more extravagant. They've got everything from swimming pools to horse tracks to their own private theatres. So yeah, Kim Jong-un's got some seriously fortified residences. With all the security measures in place, he can rest easy knowing he's safe and sound in his luxurious homes. So what have we learned about Kim Jong-un's luxurious lifestyle? Well, this guy definitely knows how to live it up. From his fancy cars and watches to his private theatres and yachts, he's living like a king. If you enjoyed learning about Kim Jong-un's lavish lifestyle, be sure to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more content on luxury living around the world. Don't miss out on the latest updates and insights into the world of the rich and famous. Your engagement fuels our passion to create and share, so show your support and stay tuned for all the latest updates. Together, we can build a vibrant and interactive community.